cars actually. Okay, they're getting right into it. Double Falco versus Double Fox. And <laughs> alright. He gets shined and Fox wrapped to the ledge and Falco just dies even if he is dead going to No. Z is how by the way, yeah, my prop is the no attack. Oh that was a perfect angle, Jesus. Yeah, the Falco seem to have control right now of the situation. Let's see the edge guard and the foxes. Ooh, they mess up. They mess up? Jesus, he died at 60. No. Okay, that was a good back here. Let's see the edge guard how? Up, yeah, he goes up, but the other Falco is there to cover. He's grabbing the legend back here. Ooh, what? The laser messed them up. They basically like twice now from the lasers. Wow. And they're still holding their own so far. It's the edge guard. Yeah, that was a very good down there. I doubt the fox could do anything else than shine him. Which would have been a trade, but then the other fox could have lasered as well. So you always go for the down there pretty much. When you have a Falco on your team, you can be way more aggressive off stage because you just know you, you can always get lasered by your uh, teammate and you survive like even a fox shine at zero. It's like crazy. Oh my god, Falcos have so much control now. We just don't lose neutral. We don't lose neutral. We just keep winning. It seems like they separate them, and then one Falco gets the, other, the job done while the other just protects. Alright, Fox is definitely gaining some momentum back here. They get the stocks. Uh, they have to close. Uh, oh my god, dude. This is a very deep from Falco. A little bit of miscommunication there from the two Falcos when they're really close to each other. It's them both losing their neutral situations and now they're in a pretty good score actually. Kind of an even game. Obviously the Foxes have the advantage to see how it's guarding. Oh, he misses the back here. He could have just grabbed the leg. The laser there was perfect and Prof just as these. Prof just as these and he's piling right now. He knows it's bad. Just kind of through the game. Let's see the recovery. Yeah, how can it manage two Falcos right now? He could have edge guarded one, but it's really hard. Oh, he's actually doing it. Back air? Oh, that missed. They're high percent. This is really possible if they fail this combo, but they did not. Oh, they didn't grab the ledge. Oh my god, this is definitely doable. Just one back air. Nair, Nair, double Nair. And the back air for the tournament winner. And now it's a 1v1, but how just jumps on a platform. He just jumps and gets full hope back here. That was game one. Falco Zays did like four times and they still won. So I don't know. This, they're looking pretty dominant uh, in my eyes right now. Look at this, look at this. Both Falcos are just getting comboed. It's crazy. We just win neutral once and Falco goes crazy and a Fox at 0%. Just winning at the same time, separate them, win the neutral interaction, and then destroy them. Backer there. Oh, Prof did back here from the ledge there. Look at that laser. Did you see that laser? Uh, Falco did on Prof there to protect his teammate. Like he was in a really bad spot, and then he just threw a laser, and Prof was like, Where did this come from? That was a very nice shine. But he can double edge guard them with a down smash there. You know, that was a really good tech chase from mine. I don't know who it is. I don't know if it's a uh, friend or death user. Oh, they cover every option with that tech chase. They were on reaction covering both like the down smash, uh, the tech in place, and the other Falco. Oh, look at this combo. The other Falco just fell from the platform and dared. That was a really good tech chase from them. It seems like they have a lot of team synergy while the other foxes don't really do as much. That was a really horrible laser. Jesus. <laughs> you just killed your own teammate there. Ooh, look at this 1v1. Mine versus how. You got like 70% from the 1v1. Prof is nowhere to be found because it's too busy with the other foxes. 
Ooh, shine back here there from the up throw. That should be the stock. Yeah, he should have thrown more lasers. Oh, he could have followed up there, maybe. Let's see the back here. Yeah, that's good. They get the double edge guard. Yeah, as I told you, Falco seemed pretty dominant. Yeah, see? Look, look at look at how how he's getting humbled right there. And Prof cannot do anything because he has a cover fault on his face. That was a great downer, but he's dead. Oh, he probably grabbed ledge. Back into shine. Yep. It's a again like scrap situations always happen. It doesn't matter the level of play. Like some situations, it's gonna be four players, four spaces on the screen going ham. So. Kind of a team kill there. Perfect angle again. He just goes straight up and how just backers and he misses. Falcos right now with a huge lead. Oh no, th this could be dangerous, but they, they managed to get out of that sticky situation. Look at the lasers from one Falco, the other Falco just being on top platform. Alright, see the combo? Jump off? No, not really. Down smash, yeah, look at them. They have center stage right now. Both edge registrations and it's over. No, Prof is alive. Yeah, it's over. They just have a lot more team synergy. I don't know what green team can do right now. They get zoned out so much and when they lose one neutral interaction, both Falcons just go harm because they're both friends in death case are really good at punish game. You get a single shine, they destroy you. I don't know what. I don't know what's gonna happen. How how can they uh, win? <laughs> tech chase from uh, he misses the tech chase. The rolling was really smart from him. Foxes, however, have the oh that was a really bad as the. Yeah, Pokemon Stadium seems like a great counter pick. I don't know why they didn't do that the, the second game actually. It's kind of weird though because without the top platform, sometimes you can't dodge the lasers that easy. Shine, shine, oh shine up B. That was a great combo. Get the percentage down. Oh, right there you see Falcos misplayed really bad. Yeah, that was a bad misplay from the Falcos because he wasn't aware that the, his teammate was comboing the other fox and he could have follow up on the tech chase there on the platform tech chase with a bear or something he wasn't aware all right the f smash there really greedy obviously how he's gonna react and go uh, go upwards so he doesn't get hit and you see the platform situation there oh nice back throw very good awareness but he gets wrecked by Prof. Oh, Prof missed the shine there. He died. He died from the FB. Yeah, this is not a good showing from Game Team, to be honest. I think they're, they can do a lot better than this. But Falcons are really good at controlling right now the flow of the game with the lasers. They want a fast paced game, they just get a shine and destroy you. They want to slow it down, both throw a couple lasers and it's completely slowed down to the flow they want. Backer there. Yeah, another backer. Oh my god, these angles from the Falcons are crazy. They both have crazy angles, actually. It's ridiculous. Both of these Falcons have crazy angles. Again, pretty dumb there for the blue team. Looking confident. To take this whole tournament, actually. Double shine. Laser grab. Prof is destroying the other Falcon. How great awareness to continue that combo, but the other Falcon just shot a laser and the combo was gone. Ooh, that was a really sick, like, kind of a duck. The other Falcon shot a laser to edge guard the Fox that's far away and Prof is just dead. Alright. Again, 1v1 situations. He can be saved there with another laser, but it was a really sticky situation with two foxes. It's really dangerous to shoot a laser at none of them actually. Ooh, nice SD from Frenzy, I guess. Okay, so we found out who Frenzy is at the end of the set. Alright, 
get snared, he's dead, he's gone, yeah. Prof can definitely do this. Shine, yeah, that's it, right, a 1v1. Who's playing? Friends is playing, alright. So it's Friends versus Prof. Down smash there was really bad. <laughs> there was no way he would have fit. Probably meant to be short of down there. Laser get shine. It's 2002 again. Very nice dash dance into short of back air. Gets the neutral win, but it doesn't really lead to anything. Just we're adding percent. Down smash on wake up. Prof just dashes around it, but misses the, the platform tech chase. Back throw. Oh! <laughs> That was the 2002 uh, back throw into dash attack into 